Hi guys, I don't have time. Now, how many times have we, have we repeated that to ourselves and to the others? I think it's just countless. Um, and it's partially true. It's true that today's life is very fast. Everything must be delivered by yesterday. Um, we want to reach the target um, almost without any effort, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so we live in 2023. Good. But having said that, um, there are techniques. And it's also true that if you kill a man, you destroy an entire universe. So everybody has its own way of thinking, working. You know, we are built differently. But having said all these very uh, trivial things, let's kick off with some advices. First, you don't have time because you don't want to have it. If you look at your typical day, it's impossible, just impossible, that you cannot really find some uh, holds, some places, some moments that you might just divert towards something else. Um, it might be uh, the time that you spend commuting. It might be um, maybe just waking up a little bit early in the morning before your family wakes up and of course going to bed a little bit earlier. It could be, um, yeah, avoiding watching Netflix uh, the, uh, the whole night, uh, maybe even two to three hours a day. And of course, TikTok and the other social media platforms. Now, so that's my point. You don't have time, we don't have time because we don't want to have it. Otherwise, with a little bit more discipline, we could just find out that time is all around us. Um, now, I'm not an expert, but you know, I got my degree in three years as expected while I was working full-time job as a project manager for a consulting firm. Uh, then I've just completed my executive MBA, uh, 18 months. Um, so, in my case, it really worked out uh, working a little bit uh, on my targets before starting, uh, the, let's say, the, the, the other work, the one that pays the bills uh, in, the, in the morning, because I'm a principal morning person. Um, then what else? Uh, um, I typically uh, want to get out every single day walking uh, like I'm currently doing now, because I think it's really important for my um, health mental and you know uh body health uh so no matter what uh in the evening uh, i just get out and start walking um but for for instance when i was in milan i couldn't really do that because I, I was just spending my day um at university so what i did decide to do was just to avoid um a part a part of uh, the public commuting. So just right after uh, getting out of the underground, I walk to the university back and forth. So two times a day and I could reach out my uh, daily targets for the steps anyhow. So this video could go on forever, but really try to think uh, uh, in terms of a strategic approach to your life. Another, another trick, uh, this uh, is really uh, about how you might um, organize your day at work. Typical error. We all tend to look at notifications uh, right away. Somebody wrote to, write to you and uh, you just want to reply immediately. Uh, you receive an email and you want to read it. Um, and you might not have really planned your day ahead. So here are my tricks. First, Every single day, I decide uh, to tackle, at the very beginning of the day, the most important task. Important and uh, complex, because I'm, I'm just fresh, you know? I'm not tired, I'm still full of energies. Uh, so I tackle those at the very beginning of my day. And then I leave uh, emailing and stuff uh, at the end of the day. Messaging, uh, um, it doesn't matter if you write me um, a message, I'm not gonna reply typically. I'm not going to reply to you immediately. Why? Because every single context switch um, costs time uh, to reset your mind and uh, it costs just energies. So it's a fatigue. Um, 
and the, and the thing that somebody says that he can or she can be uh, multitasking bullshit. It's not really possible. So plan your day ahead. Um, decide what really matters and what not. Then yes, it might happen that you're gonna be solicited. I was waiting for that. Uh, um, I need this. Uh, I need that. We are all gonna die. Okay. And here is really the the key approach. You gotta understand what what matters, what it's gonna uh, set the difference, what it's gonna set you apart from the competition, and everything else. Best effort. Who cares? We will see. Maybe I'm gonna reply to that email uh, three days uh, uh, later. The world. Uh, it's gonna uh, spin around anyhow. Another example, uh, you might think that everything uh, is just super important. Well, if everything is super important, nothing really is. For another example, um, sometimes you discover that being forced uh, to stay out of the work uh, because you are just, you know, sick, uh, the world goes on anyhow. Your team readapts. So, this is just um, a clear evidence that nobody is really indispensable. And second, when you uh, let the other people organize themselves, um, they just do that. They just do that. So prioritize, decide what is important, and just fearlessly um, focus on that. That's the key. Because everybody, me and Elon Musk have just 24 hours a day and, uh, and a very um, limited number of years on Earth. So you gotta choose. You cannot uh, reach out everything. Another example. Okay, I'm full of examples. Um, Cristiano Ronaldo, okay? Now, everybody knows him because he's very, he's probably the most disciplined um, soccer player on Earth. He reached tremendous goals, blah, blah, blah. Then we don't know if he's a good cooker. We don't know if he reads a lot of books. We don't know a lot, essentially nothing about him. But we know one thing for sure. He was able to reach the very top in his, um, in, in, in his uh, career. This was his goal. You might have something else, build the, uh, the best family in the world. Um, I don't know, get uh, four degrees. It doesn't really matter. What are your targets? And just focus on them. Everything else is bullshit. Okay. Um, another thing, uh, if you are so obsessed, so obsessed with, um, you know, being pleasant to the others, uh, um, what the others uh, might think of you and so on. Uh, well, this is another reason uh, even more to focus uh, on the most important stuff uh, because it's a little email, uh, something that um, was really trivial. Uh, it's not going to make any impact, uh, not even positive. Uh? So we just invested your time to reply to that email uh, and then what is going to happen? Absolutely zero, nothing. But if you accomplish something that is important, delivering a project, uh, uh, delivering an estimation, uh, whatever, this is going to have a huge impact. And once again, the others uh, are just going to notice Spot that. Okay, I repeated, sorry, eh? I repeated this concept over and over and over, but uh, this is something that I really advise you to try. Of course, I don't walk on, on the waters, uh, I'm just a human being, and uh, I struggle with the daily life uh, as you do, but this is something that I'm concretely uh, applying. And yes, uh, I get solicited uh, from time to time by colleagues of mine because they just need a trivial uh, answer from me. But maybe a couple of hours later, or four hours later, I reply to everybody, but I deliver the most important things. Or at least I try every single day. Thanks for watching. Uh, see you next time. Take care. Bye.